Welcome to the OES section of the Deep War tutorial. The Occupational Employment Statistics Program consists of the results of a survey of employers to produce estimates of occupational employment and wages on employees in non-farm establishments. Access the program page by clicking OES in blue at the top of the screen or by selecting the More Detailed button below the OES program data table on the main page. This Bureau of Labor Statistics program is contracted by the state of North Carolina. Approximately 12,000 establishments are surveyed every year, and three years of sample data are used to produce the results of the survey. Notice the program overview in orange located under the name of the program. This will open another page and give you an overview. Start by choosing a geography in the blue box on the left of the screen. Notice county is the smallest available geography in the OES program. Next, there are two options available from which to choose, 2001 to 2003 or 2004 to present. Data are not comparable between the two time periods because the occupational structures are different. Begin making your time selection. Other selections available in this program are released year, occupation, and data. The released year selection includes years present back to 2007, and because of the change from semi-annual to annual survey period, you will see two releases for the 2004 to 2006 surveys. The occupation selection includes occupations as defined by the Standard Occupational Classification Code, or SOC. The data selection box includes the following. Estimated employment, estimated hourly wage by mean, entry, experience, and median. Estimated annual wage by mean, entry, experience, and median and response rate percentage. Note, mean is the average and median is the most central point. Let's walk through a search. First, we'll choose Alamance County as the geography. Our time selection will be 2004 to present. Our year will be 2012. We'll choose healthcare practitioners and technical occupations and then estimated hourly wage for entry. Then click on view. Don't forget to scroll to see your results. Notice the underlined occupational code. Clicking on this will give you a description of the occupation. Thank you. This concludes the OES tutorial.